I've never enjoyed teaching as much as I have since embracing Google Apps for Education and technology in my classroom. I really believe the benefits come not just through the use of technology, but through the collaboration and connectivism that comes with being part of the global community who have also embraced these tools. I really enjoy teaching others about the skills I've learned through taking my Google exams and from my daily readings from the great educators and innovators that I follow on Google+. If I become a Google certified trainer, I plan to reach out further and take every opportunity to spread the use of these great tools for the greater benefit of teaching and learning. Well, Blair has always had time to answer questions uh, when people ask about Google tools. Uh, he often has teachers uh, in his room uh, giving them advice and um, giving them tips on how to use these tools um, or to solve the problems that they are having. Um, when I come to a, observe a classroom, there's many times that uh, teachers are there. Blair is the owner and moderator of our school's GEG. He's worked tirelessly to promote the use of this great tool to the faculty. The GEG is at the heart of his efforts to increase collaboration and sharing at our school, and it's been a fantastic resource for our teachers. Blair has shown a real desire to share his understanding of GAVE tools with the faculty by giving up his own time after school to run well-organized, fun, and useful professional development sessions. This is not because it is part of his job description, but rather because he has a real passion for the role of technology in education. Hi, today I'm going to introduce a fabulous tool which incorporates Google My Maps with Google Forms. Um, first of all, you need to um, produce a Google Form. I've got an example here. The important thing to remember with the form, using it with My Maps, is at least one of the questions, like question two here, must elicit a response that is a place name. Now, once this, you get the students to fill out this form, their answers will come through onto a Google Sheet as so. Then we simply go to My Maps, click on Create a New Map, um, and when we've created a new map, we can give it a title. The function I would like to show you is the Import function here. So if we click on Import, we're going to import from our um, Google Drive. So I want to find that spreadsheet that the students just created from their answers. There it is there. I press Select. Now it's going to ask me, um, which of the columns would I use as the place mark? And that's going to be the holiday lo location because that's the one where the answer is a place name. Then what uh, do I want to have um, the title for the place marks? There I'm going to stick the student name. We click on finish and you can see that the data is imported and the students will now be able to see a map where every one of their schoolmates, their classmates have gone for summer holidays. Enjoy.